Crash pads are meant to make your landing softer. So when you find yourself high on the rock, you can stay calm and only think of your next step. And when that next step doesn't come out as intended and gravity takes over, the compression of your crash pad reduces the impact forces acting on your body. Different crash pads do this with different efficiency. On the inside, crash pads are just layers of foam. Thickness of the individual layers is the only variable in their construction. There is one exception to this. It's named FTS, foam tube suspension. The solution is vertical. It's also highly efficient and lightweight. Vertically placed tubes are the key to everything. Soft as falls, and that's a measurable fact. Equal performance in each part of the pad. You're just as okay even if you miss the center and land on the side. Long life of the pad. FTS is also making the pad about 20% lighter than other pads of similar thickness. So with crash pads, it's like with most things. The real beauty should be found on the inside. Hi, I'm Vernay Kruder. I'm a professional rock climber from Slovenia, and this is my favorite Odson product. It's a um, Joker crash pad with the FTS foam, which uh, makes the crash pad uh, much lighter and it also absorbs the force very well. Uh, that means that you can use it for all kinds of force, even if you're doing like normal bouldering or if you're doing high balls, it will always catch your fall super nicely. Uh, enjoy your bouldering and goodbye.